गुड इवनिंग स्टूडेंट्स हाउ आर यू ऑल आई होप यू आर वेल एंड फाइन एट होम येस सो आई एम बैक विथ माई सेकेंड वीडियो ऑफ द सेम चैप्टर चैप्टर नंबर वन द फूड वी ईट सो इन द प्रीवियस वीडियो आई हैव एक्सप्लेन यू द चैप्टर आई होप यू ऑल मस्ट हैव गॉन थ्रू द चैप्टर एंड ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड इट येस ओके इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस द एक्सरसाइजेज एंड द क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर्स ऑफ चैप्टर नंबर वन फूड वी ईट Okay, let's start. So, question number one: Why do we need food? Write three reasons. The answer is: We need food because number one, food gives us energy to work and play. Number second, food protects us from various diseases and keeps us strong. Number three, food is the basic need for all the living organisms. I hope you have understood the question number one. Okay, okay. We move forward to question number two. What is balanced diet? Why it is important? So I have explained you in the chapter the meaning of the balanced diet. A diet which has all the nutrients in the correct proportions is called a balanced diet. I hope you have understood. Now the second part of the question is right its importance. So the importance of balanced diet is. it helps in the proper functioning of our body so a second answer is be completed we move to question number 3 we move to question number 3 what are protective food give examples the food which protect us from various diseases are called protective foods and what are the examples fruit vegetables are rich in vitamins and minerals Vitamins and minerals, we all know they are termed as protective food. I hope you are clear with this question number three. Okay, let's move forward to question number four. List down any three ways to avoid the wastage of food. So you have to write the three ways you can protect the care. You should not waste food. Okay, you have to write down the three ways. So the three ways are: food should be taken in small proportions. we can refill our plates if needed so one way is this to avoid wastage of food second food should be preserved to avoid it from getting spoiled we should not waste food we should always preserve it so that it does not get spoiled number 3 dry food should be kept in airtight containers we should always keep the dry food in airtight containers so these are the three ways that you can avoid the wastage of food I hope you are clear with this question. Okay, let's move forward to question number five. Give importance of carbohydrates and proteins in a body. So, carbohydrate the importance is it gives us energy, and proteins are called body building as they help us to grow. We all know that proteins are called body building foods because they help us to grow. Now we have to write the importance. of question number 6 write the importance of roughage in water roughage is important for proper functioning of our digestive system it helps in the proper functioning of digestive system water why water is important water is essential for our body to stay healthy and work properly to stay healthy and also to work properly okay i hope you are clear with this question now we move on to question number 7 give reason for having minerals in our diet what is the reason for having minerals in our diet so the reason is minerals helps your body grow develop and stay healthy the reason for having minerals in our diet is it helps our body grow and develop and stay healthy okay the question answers is being completed now we move on to the give reasons of this chapter so number 1 is we should add roughage in our diet why because it is essential for proper functioning of our digestive system we have already discussed this answer in the question answers also okay number second laborers need more carbohydrates in their food why because they do a lot of physical work number 3 we should grow more and more plants why we should grow more and more plants so that we can breathe in fresh air and enjoy plant products forever so i hope you all must have understood the give reasons yes 
so the question answers and give reasons we have discussed now we are going to discuss the exercises that are given it given in this chapter so number one is memorize and answer tick the correct answer okay you all will be able to do it because you have understood the chapter we all must be able to solve the exercise number one what makes our bones and teeth strong so what is the correct answer the correct answer is calcium which of the following gives energy the four options are being given carbohydrates proteins roughage and minerals so what is the correct answer what gives us energy carbohydrates option number a what helps to remove undigested food from our body so the four options are protein vitamins roughage and fat so the correct answer is option c roughage four which of the following are called body building foods a carbohydrate b fats c proteins d vitamins the correct answer is option number c proteins they are referred as body building foods five which of the following leads to obesity if taken in large quantities i have explained you the meaning of obesity that is when there is excess fats of fat that is accumulates in our body that is termed as obesity okay so the four options are number a carbohydrates b proteins c is fats d is water the correct answer is option number c fats what is the essential mineral in blood number a iron b calcium c sodium d potassium the correct answer is iron okay that we get from that we get from the leafy vegetables seven which of the following is a fiber rich food so the four options are as follows a bread b eggs c butter d vegetables and the correct answer is which of the following is a fiber the correct answer is vegetables what is the correct answer vegetables okay now exercise b name the following what are the two food sources of carbohydrates so you can write any two food sources of carbohydrate you can write potato and wheat two food sources of minerals so any two food sources of minerals you can write fruit milk vegetables three two food sources of vitamin a you can write papaya and carrot fourth nutrients which give more energy than carbohydrates which give more energy than carbohydrate are termed as the answer is fats fifth one two food sources of proteins any two food sources of proteins you can write egg and meat sixth one two food sources of iron any two food sources of iron you can write spinach that we call palak in hindi you can also write mint that is pudina or you can also write broccoli seventh two food sources of roughage that is salad and fruits what is the role of uh, roughage in our body it helps to remove undigested food from our body okay now we move on to the understand and answer exercise d write t for true and f for false statements number one roughage and water are also nutrients in our food the answer is false they are not termed as nutrients in our food number 2 we should never waste food yes the answer is true we should never waste food number 3 both cereals and pulses are rich in carbohydrates no the answer is false they are not rich in carbohydrate they are rich in proteins fourth one protein rich food are also called protective food the answer is false no protein rich food are not called protective food they are called body building foods the uh, last one milk is a complete food yes the answer is true milk itself is regarded as a complete diet okay i hope you all must have understood the exercises of this chapter so you have to write down the question answers in your copy try to understand it learn the exercises well till then i will be back with my next video in that video i will be going to explain you chapter number second till then you have to prepare your chapter number well number 1 the very 
well i hope you all must have understood the exercise and the question answer that we have discussed in this video okay so keep yourself safe at home bye bye